So this is a second part where I will show you how to read now the JSON we have created. I uh, mentioned that I changed something. Uh, here I renamed from toy A and toy B to color. So these are A contains toys as objects. So each one of these are toy objects. All right. So let's go. Ignore this code is for creating. Here we are reading. So very simple. We are using a file reader. We are using a file reader to read our JSON file. So we use the method deserialize from uh, the JSONer class. I think it has an one named serialize. Hmm. Okay. So this serialize method oh, somewhere I don't have used it. Okay. So, there is that method also. I am deserializing the JSON file and I'm taking that big object here. You see, this big object, all this, is taken using this here. So, let's get the name and the last name as strings. I will delete it to show you. Let's run it. So, name is Alexander and last name is GoXRF Plus. You see? Here. I will go here. How I did this? I'm using the big object JSON and I'm getting the key name. I'm getting its value, which is a string value and not a JSON object. It is a string value and I'm assigning it to a variable name named name. So, let's get now the toys array right but before that let's see the children array which is simpler you see it has just values separated with commas so this is a json array i'm getting from from the big object the children array and here i'm doing a class casting this is a down casting yes because this is an object so I'm downcasting it to JSON array alright so I'm using the for each method so for each children name print out its children name let's run it okay I have not saved it let's run it Sophie Nick John you may say me hey Alex I don't want it like this I want it separated with commas and things like that okay Okay, you can do that. It's, it is very easy. Children dot children dot for each. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So it's very easy, bro. So I can use Java stream dot uh, collectors. You see collectors dot collect collectors dot to list and I'm taking a list back so I can print with commas and whatever I want but here I want to show you something other only name I missed the code now which I have written because I have not saved it so holy name I have to write it again so let's go together bros let's take now the toys array get toys array so we need the toys array here we take the toys uh, let's print the toys uh, how it is a toys array you see this array has object and the object has g values so the first toy has a key color and its value is yellow so how we take it hmm is a little bit different here toys are so um let's go here now we need to create and here it is toys we need to create a json object 
object toy object is toy uh, here it is a toy okay toy dot jet oh, toys dot jet mm, no it is toy it is toy here why this is what is the problem with this here i will command it invalid the shape fuck okay fixed so toys dot for each toy hmm. add cast to json object right toy object let's run it bros uh, format the code control shift f let's run it uh, here i want to see what it prints okay okay so we have the object you see bros we have the object toy object dot it is easy jet we need the value color i think and let's run it oh yeah we are ready so we took the values i think it is good that i made this mistake so we can see how we have done it i think bros it is very easy leave the comments below this video i will upload the code on the github and you will find the link below the videos don't be lazy to read the description and then you ask me in the comments so i see you all very 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 soon